Hi, Ninja Marie. We're back with Maverick. So, just so everyone at home knows, Angie Marie doesn't like the slow mo. She doesn't have time to watch the slow mo. She needs to have all the videos sped up into two times faster. <laughs> So I am starting to add the down and the heel together now. More importantly though, again, I'm not in a hurry to go anywhere. If this is what the behavior that I want the dog to have, you know, I want them to become comfortable there. No, because he's absolutely perfect. Right there with the pagers, but I did. I, I really didn't even move my hand or anything. Good, watch, I'm gonna turn him. Good. Heel. And I'm rewarding him right out of that tongue. It's going to be perfect for today's slow mo. You know, Angie Marie can just not watch the slow mos, because I'll tell you who likes the slow mos, Kelly. All right, so I want to start adding my down. I want to get in a good position here, down. Oh, how absolutely perfect. He's doing absolutely perfect. I hit my pager when he went to get back up right there. Good. Good. I'm not going to be in a hurry. I'm going to pick him up with the pager. And then I'm going to start going slowly. I'm not gonna go fast. Kelly's training program, I have to wear a hoodie. <laughs> it doesn't work if you don't wear a hoodie. Heel. See my hands out of sight now. It's giving you, oh, it's giving you the mysterious edge. All right, now watch, I'm gonna spin him. Heel. I'm already thinking about my down. I'm going to get the right down. How absolutely perfect. And he understands when I put a little pressure on there. If I'm not careful, though, you know, I could end up with a zip that, you know, down, shoots ahead. Good. Maverick, I'm just going to get out of that position. Good. Tried to spin me. Good. Heel. Good. Good. Oh, these are going to be the most perfect slow mo ever. I now set the slow mos to music, heel, for your home viewing entertainment. All right, look, I'm already thinking about my down. Down. I'll tell you what he is. He's absolutely perfect. So remember, if it's going to take 40 or 50 times, if it's going to take 40 or 50 times to begin to get where we need to go. Then we need to get that under our belt. So that's for you guys at home. All right, now look down. Um, what I, I, I wanted him to get halfway up, but I need to be able to have the ability to push him down in various stages of getting up. That's the only way they're going to learn. All right, let's just do it again. Remember, I'm going to pick him up with the pager, but I'm, no, down. So whenever that leash is making good, wonderful. And I, I, my praise is behavior specific. It does nothing to do with, oh, you shouldn't have gotten up. He doesn't know that. Maverick. Good. I mean, believe it or not, this dog is only like heel. Seven months old. Good. Oh, good. I mean, boy, good. Heel. 
All right, so I'm going to go back to the same spot. Down. Wonderful. So what that says to me, and again, I'm going to gloss over that little mistake from a minute ago. I need to watch. No, down. Down. Speak of the devil. Much more closely, when I get here, I need to be right like this. He needs to be comfortable seeing me from this angle. But it's this is what it's going to take for me to keep him from getting up right now. Good. I am. Any pressure he puts on there, though, attempting to get up, I am going to add my pager. Because if there's one thing he loves, Angie Marie, it's his little chicken meatballs. Oh, we're going to have your mother get you a whole bag of these. Oh, forget a whole bag, a whole case. Your mother has a big freezer. All right, look, I'm going to get him going. Maverick. You see how I, I just now took any forward motion. Good. Heel. Good. So I'm kind of refining the heel and adding. I'm really actually still defining the heel. Heel. I'm going very slow and deliberate. leash down. Down. I'm adding my pager right there, okay? And then I'm going to get around here where there is no other option than just stay there. Alright guys, we got to get the slow-mo. So be right back. Bye.